businesses can bring a big boost in business, but one general manager tells us they've been busy since reopening and now they're looking to hire. Sarah Madison reports. Many families spent this Easter Sunday together and a lot of them went out to support businesses. Salt at our Kaka'ako held a weekend-long holiday-themed event that drew many folks in and opened opportunities for restaurants and stores. I think helps because we have a lot of people visiting Saturday and Sunday and it was pretty busy at the beginning, you know, in the morning. Sea Life Park also held its own scavenger hunt for the kids. We did a very soft Easter event uh, this year. Normally it's much bigger, but because of the concern about crowds, we kept it a very small, intimate event. Nonetheless, many were excited to be out, even the adults. We're glad that we're here today to show them and give them the experience of Sea Life Park. The park has been closed to the public for about a year. It has been 354 days since uh, March 17 was the day we closed and we reopened on March 6. While Sea Life Park is currently running three days a week as opposed to seven like before, they've been very busy. We are hoping to open up more days as soon as we can hire more people. That's been our biggest challenge. Uh, we have brought back many of our furloughed employees, but we are looking for more employees. King says it's a great problem to have and is excited about the tremendous public support from those who have missed the park. <laughs> well, I mostly miss about seeing the fish and the birds. Yeah, um, the kids love it. They love going to feed all the fishes, see the dolphins, and uh, feed the birds. It's a great activity for them to get out. Sarah Madison, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.